Floppy disks are still around in 2025 and companies are somehow keeping the supply alive. Nobody actually manufactures new floppy disks anymore. The magnetic media coating manufacturers are all gone, but there's still massive stockpiles floating around. A guy named Tom Persky runs the last major floppy disk business in the US and he's sitting on half a million disks in various formats. And he sells about a thousand per day. When Sony ended production, he bought up a couple million disks and he occasionally gets pallets of unused floppies from companies when they clear out warehouses. His customers aren't just nostalgic nerds. Industrial machinery that's 20 or 30 years old still uses floppy drives for loading data and programming. Boeing 747s were using floppies to update navigation databases until they retired that fleet in 2020. Hospitals have old CT scanners and ultrasound machines from the 90s that need floppies for configuration files. Musicians actually still use vintage synthesizers and samplers from Roland and Akai that require floppies to store sound patches. The US nuclear arsenal used 8-inch floppies until 2019 and Japan's government only stopped requiring floppy disk submissions in 2024. Tom says he's got maybe 4 more years before the supply runs out completely. The drives are also harder to hack. Upgrading costs millions in some cases, so industries just keep using them until they literally can't anymore. 